All right, shalom, shalom. Uh, first and foremost, as always, we're going to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakakodash. Also, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who rule and teach well in the scriptures. And salutations to all you brothers out there who are pushing this word in all truth and all sincerity. And um, as you can see on you know the title, all right, you know as it says, uh, continue to you know separate yourself from Babylon, all right. You know, um, uh, I had an interesting conversation with the uh, the brother Shakaria today, and we were just talking about how you know you don't want to really be um, too close, all right, to people who are in the world still, all right. You know, because these people at any moment. You know they can turn on you, all right. You know, um, watch the uh, movie The Matrix. Okay, there's a particular scene where you had the character Morpheus. He was training the character Neo. All right, in that simulation, um, in that simulation, they were in like a downtown, you know, area, and they were walking through, you know, the midst of people, and um, pretty much, you know, Neo got distracted by uh, this woman, right, and. Um, uh, uh, turns out that that woman ended up turning uh, to be uh, turning out to be an agent, right? She she you know transformed to Agent Smith, right? You know and um you know and that's one of the characters that wanted to kill, you know the uh, uh you know the heroes in in, in the uh, the movie, right? And uh, uh you know they froze everything, and the, the dude uh, uh Morpheus told Neil like, look, you know the same people that you're trying to save, you know from the Matrix. If they don't, they're so basically engulfed in that system that, look, they're not going to want to actually be free. And they're going to actually fight you to stay in the system, okay? And that's these people out here. A lot of these, you know, uh, um, a lot of your so-called, you know, friends of the world, co-workers, your, you know, even your own family. A lot of them want to still be stuck in the matrix, man. You know, this uh, uh, captivity, Babylon, basically, you know, they want to stay here. And with that being said, if they're not in this truth, man, you have to separate yourself from them, okay? You can't keep them in your company like that because these people are going to get you killed, man. All mm -hmm. right? You got something, Mark? Yeah. This is uh, 2 Corinthians uh, uh, 6 and 14. It says, Be not un unequally yoked with unbelievers. For what fellowship have the righteous with the unrighteous? Sorry, righteousness with unrighteousness. What, what fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness and what communion what communion have light with darkness you know see yeah, these people are in that everlasting darkness man see we're the light and the thing is they um how what did it tell you in uh peter man they hated the light because their oh, deeds were evil john. John, john i think john the third chapter yep these people they, these people hated the light man and so there's always that there's always that enmity there, man. And how the brother said, like they're really they're trying to fight to stay in this. See, we're trying to fight to get out of it. Mm -hmm. You know, and it's evident, okay? Because look, if um, especially now, right? You see all these things happening in the world. You would think that look, these people would want to actually get out of this situation. You know, that they, they would want to stop having to you know follow these particular protocols, rules, and regulations. All right, with you know having you know a uh, multiple mask on or having you know an injection you know you would think that they want to they would want this to stop right but they really don't because they're not turning to Yahweh Bashim Shai. they may complain about it but look ultimately what do they want well if we keep following these rules and regulations things are going to go back you know to normal oh we're going to be able to go to the baseball game you know we're going to be able to go to the grill out you know go to the festival you know this day and the third that's what these people are looking forward to, man. They're not looking forward to the kingdom of Yahweh Bashim Shai. Where all good things dwell, where complete, uh, where righteousness is going to reign and flourish, it's going to be completely in order. They don't want that, you know. These people want to stay in this uh, uh, wicked society, man. You know. So, um, you got more? Yeah, it's like two okay, three more. It says, uh, "In what concord have Mashiach with Bilal, or what part have?" He with an infidel, and an infidel is a person without faith, man. The faith, faithless, you know. Hey, these people are they? They're faithless, man. See, like, hey, like, pursue it to that parable with the five wise, five foolish virgins. See, we represent the five wise, man. That took the oil, that got the uh, understanding while you could get it, and you know we moved off two things, man. Hey, th that fear, 
and their faith. And see, these people, they don't fear or have faith, man. But when the time comes down for them to be defended, who are they going to look for? They're going to look for the people who have, uh, quote unquote, resources and answers. And who's going to be at the top of the food chain in that day? The prophets. Because they're going to actually have, Yahweh Shai is actually going to be with them. You know, they're going to have the spirit with them, man. It says, um, and what agreement have the temple of Yahweh with idols? And, you know, who's there, who are these people's main idol? Their main idol right now is Esau Edom, man. That's their God. That's who they serve. You know, so whatever Esau's will is, that's what they're going for, man. Esau's will is to get them chipped and to kill half of them, if not more than half. And they're perfectly fine with that, man. Mm -hmm. You know, here it is. You got uh, these news outlets telling you what this thing is going to do to you, what it actually is. And they brush it. They just brush it off like, oh, no, nah, maybe it's not going to be like that. Oh, well. I, I, I had a guy, a customer, I was, you know, chatting it up with him. This guy literally tells me how he had a co-worker their son you know got jabbed and you know stabbed right <laughs> or stabbed and jabbed right you know now he's gonna slap no bro this this, this uh, 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 young man literally went to bed that day right after he got it never woke up died oh yeah that's, that's what I mean he's on that slab oh, oh, that okay, yeah, slab. Yeah. he huh. got he got stabbed jabbed laid, laid on a slab yeah. and this guy's still considering taking it and he said, what did he say to me? He said, might not be me, though. He said that everybody's DNA is different. Some people are reacting, you know, a particular way. And he goes, you know, uh, you know, more than likely it's not going to happen for, you know, most people. And I'm just looking at him like, but there's a possibility that you really want to take that risk th that you can get put to death. These people are playing Russian roulette out here. You're considering that risk. But you know what? Hey, <laughs> it says, I'm going to keep reading. This says, it says, ye are the temple of the living power. You know, say so it says it actually it says we are the temple, the temple of God. It says, as God has said, I will dwell in them and walk in them and I will be their power and they shall be my people. Yeah, so ooh, these people really have no understanding of the scriptures. Ultimately, they, they, they just they, the Lord isn't with them, man. You know, so these people, yeah, let, let, let these people go out here and do what they got to do. But you don't want to basically. uh I got another. You got, you got anything? I had another one. Yeah, I had a few. Um, You want to grab that one real quick then? Yeah, this is 2 Timothy 3 and uh, 13. It says, But evil men, seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. Yeah, these people aren't going to get it, man. These people believe one plus one is three, man. These people are gone. And see, the thing is, if you're around them, they're going to try to fight and claw and take you with them, man, because they're going down. Mm-hmm. It says, but continue in the things which thou hast learned and has been assured of. And you know, what have we been assured of? Hey, the kingdom's coming. Yahweh Shai is on his way. What to do and what, what, what to do and what not to do, man, through these scriptures. It says, and knowing whom, it says, of knowing whom thou hast learned them. From what? The apostle, the elder apostles on down, man. See, these people are going to be in pitiful case, man. And you, and like the other thing is, you just don't want to be, yoked. you don't want to be yoked with these people when these judgments start. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because you can get caught up in it. Yeah. Hey, you, you, you be around these people. You know, hey, you might be, hey, you see it all the time. People are at clubs, whatever, just partying, having a good time. Next thing you know, people are getting shot up, you know. Yep. A couple people got, you know, injured. One person got died, you know, one person died. You know, a car crashed, you know what I'm saying, or two. You see that all the time, man. Why be around this stuff? It's not profitable. All right, it's it's not profitable, you know. Um, especially you know as the days keep uh, growing, uh, as they continue to grow, uh, eviler and eviler. All right, but I got um a few right here. This is Sirach chapter twenty-seven. So, I'm gonna start at. Well, you got it too. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> this is Sirach twenty-seven. I'm gonna start at eleven. Ock. It says the discord discourse of a godly man is always with wisdom. Okay. So if you're a godly man, you're always going to be dwelling with wisdom, okay? And that's why it's important to be around the brethren. And it's actually going to tell you that a, a little bit. Actually, you know, I'm going to keep reading. Uh, it says, but a fool changes as the moon, okay? It, it, look, these um, these people, they change like the moon, right? Hey, one minute they're into this philosophy, the next minute they're into that, you know? Hey, they're on, hey, what does it say? Uh, um... Uh, um a double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. What is it? The book of James? You know? These yeah. people are unstable. 
Okay? You know, they, they, man, you don't know if they're going left or right half the damn time. They don't even know it. And why is that? Because they uh, 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 are basically controlled by their emotions. They don't have rule over their spirit. You see, once you're uh, in this truth, you, you can learn how to control that. You can, can control your emotions. All right? Hey, you're around brothers that are, are focused. All right? Hey, our eyes are single. You know? All right? Hey, we're, we're focused uh, on getting into the kingdom of, uh, of heaven. You know, getting that salvation. All right? And with salvation comes what? You know, us being, you know, uh, 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 um, you know, changed, glorified, you know, and actually getting physical dominion, man. That's what we're, you know, uh, looking forward to. And that's, that, that's our goal right now. What are these people's goal, man? To be the next rapper, the next athlete, you know, they want to, um, you know, uh, uh, or the next scam or something, you know what I mean? That's what they're into. Can't be around these people, man. All right, and I'm gonna keep reading. It says, uh, verse twelve: If thou be among the un undiscreet, observe the time. And why is that? Because you don't know if things are gonna pop off or not. Yeah. Because yeah, you you may turn your head for two seconds, and next thing you know, there's a brawl in front of you. You know. Yeah. That, that uh, is it is it indiscreet or undiscreet? It says undiscreet in my uh. Okay, but it, it basically means without uh without discretion, man. Mm. They don't have that discernment. Nope. They don't know. They, 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 these people. They just act. They don't think. Yeah, they don't. They don't know how to judge situations. You know, you see it all the time. You, you know, I've seen you know footage of uh, all that stuff. You know, out there in Miami and all that. The, the spring break stuff. You just have all these women literally fighting like uh, like men out there yeah. in the middle of the street. Have no uh, uh, judgment. Just you know, instead of just hey, just you know, uh, let's say if you had a disagreement with somebody. Instead of just parting ways, you know what I mean? Hey, you you know, hey, you start doing your own thing and you get away from them. Hey, they, they get away from you. They do their own thing. These people start fighting over the simplest things, man. I remember I was on the train uh, coming from, uh, it was like a while back. I was on the train with this one chick I used to work with. And a big a big fight happens on the train where they down there have to uh, stop the train. Instead of like staying where we were, this person actually decides to run to the fight. And then she couldn't, so she couldn't necessarily get to the fight. She just starts saying, like, fuck you and yelling at people in the fight. I'm like, I'm looking, I'm like, why would you do that? But, you know, these that's that's the things that these people do, man. They don't they don't think what's going to happen to them, man. Like, these people are these people are ready and willing to die, man. Yep. And it says here, but be continual among men of understanding. Yep. And why is that? Because... You have the same mindset, all right. You have the you have the same uh, uh you know goals, aspirations, okay. Hey, a brother can correct you if you're going off. You can correct a brother if he's going off. You know, help each other out. Got that love for one another. These people don't. Hey, this is a cruel world out here. You know, if you're not, uh, uh, you know, amongst this brotherhood, hey, you're uh, around a bunch of what, man? Wolves, man, thieves, murderers. All right. People that don't have, uh, 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 they're not uh, out here for your best interest. They don't have morals. Yeah, they don't have not, none of that. They can lie to you and say they have, uh, they like in the world, they'll tell you, oh man, you gotta have a cold, man. There's honor amongst thieves. That's, that shit's fake, man. Mm -hmm. There's real code as these scriptures, man. Yeah. You got, you're not gonna find, like, look, man, you can have a guy out here fucking, this dude's selling all the heroin. He's a neighborhood superstar. Probably clapping this man's wife, doing that, doing this. And then all of a sudden, this dude gets go. He goes to jail, and he he snitches on all his uh people that were under him or above him. And people are like, why did he do that? It's like he was already selling heroin. You expect this guy to really have integrity? Like, look, man, these these people, these people are like, man, they're, they're living in a world of uh, hypocrisy and lies, man. That's their whole foundation: hypocrisy and lies. And when it's when it's put hey, under any scrutiny, it's gonna crack. Hey, they always, what, what's that uh, a famous saying? Fake it till you make it. Oh. That's these people. Fake it till you make it. You know? Yeah, they don't deal with judgment. They don't deal with the truth. Yep, I was just going to say that, yep. I got one to back you. You got more than... I got one uh, to back you up. Yeah, 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 back... Uh, get that out. I got a, a little bit more in that, and also I got another precept. All right, this is uh, Ciroc 9. I'm going to start at 13. It says, Keep thee far from a man that hath the power to kill. Mm. So shalt thou now doubt the fear of death. And if thou come unto him, make no fault, lest he take away thy life presently. 
This is talking about really being amongst like quote unquote murderer, you know what I mean? Or anyone that could really take your life in that in that regard. It says, Lest he take hey, thy Basalaki, life. Can I say this? Scriptures in the book of John, right? It talks about that, you know, there's only one door, one way, right? Yeah. What does it say? You know, those that are trying to come up another way, what do they count it as? Murder. Thief and yeah. a murderer. That's these people, man. You can still uh 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 say that all these people, man, hey, they got that spirit on them as a thief, a murderer, okay? You know, they're you know, they're dogs, whoremongers, all that stuff, man. Yeah, they're filth, man. They, they, these people are filth because really, what does the scripture say? No, was it? Uh, uh, I think Psalms um, 119 it talks about how uh, uh, how can a man cleanse his way or a young man cleanse his way? All right, by the washing of the word. See, these people, they, they haven't been washed by this word. They're, hey, they're, they're still drinking that Babylon juice. So they're dirty. They're filthy. You can't trust these people. Yeah. Okay. It's With anything, man. Come on. You you don't know if they're gonna flip. That's the that's the main point of everything. You want to separate yourself from these people because you don't know when they're gonna flip, man. Yeah, not if when. Yeah, exactly. Cause they're not built on the same. Um, it's like look, man. Like say you got an NBA team, right? Like say it's LeBron, whatever fucking team he's on. A guy comes out of the out of the stand, out of the out of the stands. He has his fucking jersey on. He's got his number twenty four jersey on. And he just goes sits down on LeBron. Next, he's gonna he just goes sits down on the bench. They're gonna get that guy the fuck out of there, man. Nobody knows this guy. This guy hasn't been proven. Mm -hmm. You know, it's good to say prove a friend, man. These people aren't your friends out here. These people are just hey, what is it, Agent Smiths? Yeah, that's all they are. Oh, uh, it says um. Yeah, they're, oh, that's all they are. They're agents for for Babylon, man. Yep. You know, because hey, once stuff gets real out here, once there's no food. Okay? Or lack of food, once there's lack of water, when they don't have their cigarettes, their, you know, their pills, their weed, all right, their TV, you know, their entertainment, once that's taken away from them, you're going to see the, the true colors of these people. Mm -hmm. Okay? These people, as the brother said, they have no integrity, man. These people are going to fold quick, and they're going to point fingers. They're going to say, yeah, 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 my cousin's a part of that. Yeah, hey, he's a black Hebrew Israelite. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, oh I just, oh, hey, you, you gonna give me some money? I just gotta point out where he's at. Yeah, yeah, I got you, I got you. All right, cool. Come. That's what's gonna happen, man. Quickly. This is, uh, thus he take away thy life presently. Remember, thou goest in the midst of snares, and thou walkest upon the battlements of the city. You know, so we're in, we're in snares out here, man. Everything, every everybody you deal with is a potential fucking trap, man. Hey, like how the brothers even going to like the, the mindsets of these people, man. There was a there was a movie, um, fuck with uh, there was a movie with uh that dude Paul Walker in it, where basically his next door neighbor's kid was like getting beat up, and this dude everywhere he went he was in another situation, like he had to deal with a pimp. Next thing you know, he had to deal with some uh some some he got away from the pimp, then some fucking uh child molesters got him. Got away from that, then like the Russian mob got him. I forget the name of the movie, but that's how this place is, man. You know, you're walking among snares in the battle among the battlements of this amongst the battlements of the city. It says, and as 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 near as thou canst, try to understand thy neighbor, and consult with the wise. You know, that's who we consult with, man. Our counsel is way ultimately with with the wise, man, with the Akim, the Alahim. We're not, we're not getting, we're not counseling with these people, man, because these people don't know how to judge it right. It says, "Let thy talk be with the wise, and all thy communication in the law of the Most High." Exactly, be among the wise. It says it in Malachi the third chapter. All right, that those that fear the Lord, you know, they they, they uh um, spake often one to another. Okay. <laughs> And why is that? Because, can I get this real quick, Ark? It says here in Amos 3 and 3, can two walk together except they be agreed? Yep. That's why they're talking to one another. That's why a righteous man is going to be around another righteous man. Because they're in, in agreement. Okay? Yep. You, can, you, you can't walk with these worldly people for too long. You're, a, you're in a disagreement. Yeah. All right? Hey, you're going to talk about how, oh, uh, you know, pork is, you know... Is going off. You're gonna talk about how shaving's going off. You're gonna say, "Oh, you know what? That, that, that's not a real holiday." 
Yeah. You know, Christmas is not a real holiday. Easter. The conversation is going to vex you yeah. at some point. You, you, there's going to be a clash at, at, at some point. You know? Oh. There's going to be a clash. So either you're going to walk away or they're going to walk away. Yep. It's simple. Here's uh, one more on this one. Uh, this is Rock 9 and uh, 16. It says, And let just men eat and drink with thee, and let thy glory be in the fear of the Lord. You know, so hey, ultimately, we fear y'all by Shemir al -Shah. That's our common denominator here, man. And it said, let the let just men eat with thee, man. I'm not sitting down having a conversation with some fucking niggas, man. For, for what? What are you going to get out of it? A headache? Or worse? Shit, the headaches, the least of your worries, man. These people are plotting continually, man. Mm-hmm. That's right. Go. Uh is that it on there? Yeah. It's on this is uh, back in Sirach 27. I'm going to read 13. It says, The discourse of fools is irksome. You see, the discourse of fools is irksome. It, 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 it's just irritating. It's annoying. You know? That, that stuff gives, starts giving you a damn headache, man. When you're around these people. Mm-hmm. Hey, from, from the, their actual physical conduct, okay? To their speech, man. You know, you know what they're talking about. You're going to get annoyed with them talking about adultery. Okay? You're going to get annoyed with them smoking in front of you. Alright? Acting loud, being just damn demons, man. Okay? To them trying to scam and scheme. Yep. To them trying to, you know... Uh, then you got the jakes that are, you know... Oh, let's be, you know... You know extra American and, and, you know... Hey, let's, you know... Be a coon and... You know, hey, you know, hey, buddy, you know, hey, you know, uh, make sure you get a good job, go to college, get in the fraternity. You know, that, that stuff is annoying, man. All right, that's annoying as hell. You don't want to be around that. And it says, and their sport is in the wantonness of sin. All right, you see, they, 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 that's a sport to them, okay, to do wickedness. It's a damn sport, man. They they actually you, you got Jake's they'll have competitions, man. They'd be like, oh hey, let's see who can sleep with more uh uh, uh you know we'll men's see if I wives. Can take these bitches out here. Yeah. Let's see who can get the most in a, you know in a month. Oh, I slept with, you know, uh you know, ten ten women that had men already. Oh, you only got ten, brother? I did fifteen. <sighs> you know? That's what they're into, man. Yeah. They'll have a damn... They'll bet, too. Niggas are professional athletes at their wickedness. Yep. You know? So you can't be around these people. Continue to separate. And hey, we're getting closer and closer to the end, man. Hey, uh, you got some? No. Can you get that, um... What is it? Uh, um... 2 Timothy 3. It's really in the fourth verse, but just start at 3, Ock. 2 Timothy... I think 2 and 3. 2 and 3. All right. Man, as we get closer to the end, you can't be entangled with the affairs of this life, man. All right? You can't be, you know, hanging out with your, you know, so-called family, you know, your mom, dad, whatever, children, you know, brother, sister, cousins. Can't be with, you know, the your worldly friend that you have known since kindergarten. Okay? Can't be around these people for too long. Mm-hmm. Because look, they, they, they've invested in Babylon. You've invested in Yahweh Bashim al Shai. All right? You can't serve two masters or, you know, uh, you, you can't be around these people. Kind of 2 Timothy 2 verse 3 says, Therefore, uh, so like, therefore, thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Yahweh Shai, Mashiach. Mm -hmm. No man that wharf entangleth himself with the affairs of this life. That's right. You can't entangle uh, uh, yourself with the affairs of this life. You, know, you got to separate. So you don't want to have a... You don't want to be attached to anything out here, man. Because mm -hmm. everything's going down, man. See, these people these people are attached, man. These people have uh, obligations, so to speak, you know? Mm -hmm. See, our obligation is this truth. That's 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 it. It says... Uh, yeah, you said they're attached and they, and they don't want to let go. Nah. See, we, we're, we're letting go. And as we continue to get closer to the end, we got to just... Continue to let go more and more and more. And look, some of the things that we have to let go, it's not going to feel comfortable. All right? We're going to be, feel real, be um, 
We're gonna feel real uncomfortable. It's gonna hurt. Hey, let, me, let me jump you know? up one more. Let me jump. Let me reread that verse three again. Oh, it says, "Thou for endure hardness, as a good soldier of Yahweh Shai Mashiach." You know the heart. That hardness, man. It's it's hard to let go of. You know, whatever age you are, that's how many years you you've been in Babylon. You know, minus of course the years you've been in this truth. But it's like, look, you've seen these people your whole life or whatnot. You gotta let go. You know, that's a quote unquote a, a hard thing to do. You know, your flesh is all like, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, but hey, the spirit has to win on this one, man. Mm -hmm. See, we're, we're, we're leaning to the spirit. See, these people are leaning to the flesh, man. They can't, see, they can't, they don't have, it's not given to them to understand, man. No. Nope. Even when this place is being blown to bits and everything's collapsing, they're still going to, they're still going to fight to hold on, man. They're still yep. not going to repent. That's why the scripture saying in the book of Luke, a very short verse, what does it say? Remember Lot's wife. Sodom and Gomorrah and the other three cities were going down, okay? That place was getting bombarded with, with uh, fire and brims, uh, brimstone, right? What did she do? Lot's wife still looked back, okay? She still looked back, and it, it was because she... It wasn't just because they lost, you know, particular, uh, you know, goods and, and resources. It's really because she loved, <laughs> she loved the lifestyle, man. She loved what was in there because you got to remember, Sodom and Gomorrah was a mighty kingdom in the rest of the cities. That wasn't just like just some random like, you know, yeah. uh, 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 towns or, you know, just a, whatever. You know what I mean? Those were actual like, like that was an actual like empire because you got to remember, right? Still going. Okay. Yeah, if it's still going. You got to remember, uh, uh, Abraham, he actually fought. You know what I'm saying? He, he, you know what I'm saying? He, he actually had warfare with, you know, with these places Come and all on. that. They dealt with him, okay? The devil's the actual kingdom, man. And that place, uh, uh, she didn't want to let go of it, okay? And you see a lot of our own family members and all that stuff, and your wife, whatever, whoever it may be, man, I don't know. Whoever your you know, uh, loved one is, hey, some of them are going to actually, st they're going to look back. They're not going to want to let go. So that's why you have to just, hey, you just got to uh, separate yourself from them. I'm going through that right now. I mean, hey, I love my family, you know. Got, got, you know, got two brothers, man. You know what I'm saying? I got, uh, I get, you know, got my parents, and, and I barely, as time keeps going by, I'm, especially with this whole thing that's going on, I've been really separating myself. Really? I don't want to be attached to to them, you know. So the Lord is coming. That's how you know the Lord is coming back. He said he's coming back to uh, basically cause those divisions. Mm-hmm. That's how you know the Lord, that's how you know the Lord is on his way back because now that what hap what's happening with this pandemic is actually causing divisions. That's right. You know, you don't want to be amongst them because they we we always bring this out. These people are all hypocrites. One minute they believe in the situation, the next minute they don't. They only believe in it when it fits their agenda. All right. Mm -hmm. You can't be around that, man. Hey, going back to uh, what the scripture said, these people are double-minded. They change like the moon. Can't be around people like that. See, the brothers, they, we've been talking about the same thing for years. Hey, we, we, we haven't changed our outlook. We haven't changed our thought process. It's been the same thing since we've gotten into the truth. You know? Mm -hmm. Our eyes are single. We're looking forward to, man, we are... Hey, we're laboring to get into the kingdom. Hey, we're grinding. We're, we're pushing. We're trucking. We are not stopping, man. You know? We can't... Hey, we, we, look, the Lord's not stopping. You know? So, so why... How much more... How much more us? If the Lord's not stopping, how much more us, man? Mm -hmm. Hey, look, if you stop, what's going to happen? You're going to fall back into the world. You're going to drop the plow. And then you're going to get, you know, uh, aided up by, them, you know, by the spirits. You know what I mean? Spirits are going to get you, and you're just going to be bugged out and through. Then eventually, the Lord's going to just smoke you, period, man. Physically, he's going to exterminate you. Come on. This is a uh, no man that wharf entangleth himself with the affairs of this life. That's right. That he may please him who have chosen him to be a soldier. And you, you can't look back being a soldier, man. If you look back, you're going to get smoked. You know, we always bring up that movie, Dead Presidents. My buddy said, uh... I don't look at pictures of my kids. The second you start doing that shit, you're dead out there. Mm -hmm. You know, we're looking to the end game, man. See, these people, you could tell that they're still living in the past. Even with this pandemic, people are, 
posting pictures from 2017, 2014. Oh, when I was traveling and being a whore and doing this and that. You know, all that's all that. With, with everything that's going on, with this big financial collapse, with these famines that's going on, with these wars that's going on, uh, this sex trafficking, this child human trafficking, everything that's going on, you know what they see? You know what they really see? Oh, man, when am I going to get back to, to the NBA game? Oh, yeah, I want to go to Atlanta. I want to go to Atlanta. I want to go to Texas. I want to go to spring break. They don't even care about the fuck the real problems or or they don't even see them. They don't care to see them. They got stimulated, Ark. Mm -hmm. They got stimulated right now. They're all good. They got the, you know, uh, the 1400 for themselves. <laughs> they got maybe two, three kids. So that's about what another 45. Four, th th these people got like $5,000 plus unemployment or even if they got a job or whatever. That they're getting like, you know, a couple thousand. These people just make 10 G's in a month, man. Let's just say 10, 12 G's. These people are losing their damn mind, man. Off of that. What, what is, think about it. Most Jake, they barely get uh, 2,000 a month, man. You know what I'm saying? He saw I gave them 10. These people are getting 10, 12,000. They're losing their damn minds, man. Can't tell them nothing. You know? Hell, they think they're in good case. They don't want this to stop. Oh, boy. You can't tell them nothing, bro. They got that Kanye demon on them. Can't tell me nothing. And you think a person like that who, who, just for lack of better words, a nigga who hasn't had shit in his fucking bet in his life, now he's fucking coming up, getting all this shit. You think he's ready to lose or stop that? No. Exactly. These people are gonna do any and everything to hold on to it, man. Hey, you now that you brought that up, can I? You got any more to that or no? Uh, no, I think that was it. Let me just get this real quick. I'll probably end it off with this. Lord willing. This is uh, 1 John 2 and, uh, and 15. It says, Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life, is not of the Father, but is of the world, and that's what this place uh, place promotes. Okay, hey, you, you know those carnal things, you know pride, you know uh, the you know uh, uh, you know what you have, mm -hmm. you know oh, I got this car and that house, so I can go on this trip. That's what they push, right? And it says, um, and the world passeth away, and that's what's happening. This world's passing away. The scriptures tell you in the book of Corinthians. The fashion of this world bypasses, man. It's fading away, man. It's through. Look at this system. Look at this place. It's getting worse every year. It's not getting any better. And we, the, this brother and I always bring it out. Go watch these old, like, 70s, 80s, 90s movies. Right? Where those, you know, uh, in that movie, it's based in that time era. Everybody was doing good. Yeah. Everyone's, you know... Hey, you know, giving high fives to each other. Hey, drinking at the at the local bar, watching the you know the baseball game. You know, get getting some uh you know hot dog and some peanuts, man. You know, going to the club. You know what I'm saying? Doing good. Now look at everything. It's dead out. Hey, look, man, we bring this out. You go to downtown Chicago right now. The two main uh, streets, State uh, State Street and Michigan Avenue. Okay. Smoke. It's like a ghost town, man. It's done. This is it's done. Real. Especially with this pandemic. It ain't coming back. And shit. Oh, my God. This is actually beautiful, man. Because, hey, you know, it makes our chance greater, man. The water y'all bought Shemar uh, Shaffer giving us this truth and allowing us to see it. Because. Yeah, bro. Yeah, it's like. Hey, that's why you got to uh, uh, be humble. All right? It, 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 it be meek and thank you how about Shimmy Al Shai every day that you're in this truth because you know what you can be one of these bug outs out here that's all I keep thinking about hey man I follow people I purposely follow old friends of the world on social media I don't even talk to them I don't even comment like anything I follow them on purpose so I can see how not to be basically like man that could have been me that could have been me Mm -hmm. Man, it says uh, back in First John two and seventeen, and the world by the world passes away, and the lust thereof. But he that doeth the will of the Most High Yahweh abideth forever. 
And that's what's going to happen, all right? Hey, the men of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai, they're about to get glorified, all right? We're about to get exalted. And we're going to be remembered. Hey, we're going to have those everlasting names, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, you see, hey, all, all your, hey, man, your Michael Jordans, your Cardi B's, your, uh, I don't know, Jennifer Lopez, uh, who else is out here, man? Mark Anthony, man, uh, 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 who, I, I don't even know, man. I'm trying to name anybody and everybody, man. All right? Whoever it is, man, Jay-Z, Beyonce, uh, LeBron, Kanye, I don't know. All, all the right? people who won't be remembered. <laughs> yeah, these people, they're not going to be remembered. You see, the day the men that stood stiffly for the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai, those are going to get remembered in the kingdom, and it's going to be everlasting uh, remembrance. Right, our works, Lord willing, are going to get passed down from generation to generation. All the, all the Israelites that come, you know, after you know uh, uh, this this whole ordeal, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And that's what we want. We don't want a, a, a what is it? A corruptible crown. We want that incorruptible crown. Yeah, hey, because it says uh, if you're going to abide forever, that's immortality. To, to see immortality, not to die, that takes power. The elect are going to have power, man. See, these people, they don't have any power, man. Like, these these people's works are going to be forgotten, man. You know? Hey, when uh, the EMP hits, you know, when this place breaks down, nobody's going to be fucking... Jehu. People are going to remember him. And fucking go after like you know what I mean that's what the beautiful part about it hey you wanted to be famous so bad now you became a target but you know hey you're not gonna be remembered in the kingdom and mm -hmm. the kingdom's gonna endure forever hey 20,000 years into the kingdom nobody's gonna be fucking thinking about Jay-Z that guy's gonna be a fucking peon he's still gonna be the Israelite but it's just like shit nope that's you know? right you got anything else though nah I don't got anything else yeah that's pretty much it you know hey Separate yourself from Babylon, man. This place is about to be destroyed, man. As the scriptures say, Babylon is falling, is falling, man. All right? We're watching the collapse of this, you know, entire kingdom, this society. All right? And look, you don't want to be a part of it, man. So what do you got to do, man? Separate yourself from this place. Mm -hmm. Okay? That's what you have to do. Come out of her, my people. So everything starts off spiritually first. And eventually, Lord willing, hey, we physically get out of here soon. You know, yeah. and with first, that, so because it's like first step to flee in Babylon. What does it say? Uh, flee to Mr. Babylon, deliver every man his soul. Mm -hmm. Got to deliver your soul, man. By what these scriptures? If, hey, what does it say? The, through knowledge, the just shall be delivered. Mm -hmm. All right, that's in the book of Proverbs. That's how you're going to get delivered. Okay, through the knowledge of Yahweh Bashim Shai, having that wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, having the names of the living power in your forehead, man. You know. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Man. You know, and with that, hey, we hope that this was edifying. You know, we're going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Rakakodash. Also, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone and salutations to all the brothers out there. Shalom and a Baba Ball. Baba Ball.